Hello everyone, welcome to my end of year vlog. It's a bit dark in here, so let's get some light on. Ah! 2019, well, what a year it was. Acting. I started off this year by doing a little bit of stunt work for a film called Shadow Division. Thanks to a wrestling training student, I managed to get into a big college film. Catherine Ferguson, who was directing it, got me in as anger for the nod towards Inside Out for this for this big project, and then had me back in as a zombie, where the makeup, as you can see now, was close to Hollywood, as you can get. I went home in this makeup. I had funny looks. Then I worked on Casualty twice. The second time I worked on Casualty, I was in one scene where you could barely see my feet, so it was not worth mentioning. His Dark Materials aired later in 2019, where episode one, you can see me for a few seconds. Wrestling. Started the year with a feud with Freak Show. I'm hoping that my feud with him will continue. But due to many concussions, I was told I wasn't allowed to wrestle on medical grounds. April 20th was my last match with Max Wilson, which I won before hanging up my boots. However, once you got the bug in pro wrestling, you cannot get rid of it. I did a quick one-off appearance, did a classic Royal Rumble style entrance. To be the last two and eliminated by none other than Freak Show. That's 1 1, and I have ordered new boots. I'm coming for you. My return match behind closed doors at the DWA training center was against Xander Gray, which I picked up another win. And the Devon Wrestling Association promoters are happy for me to come back for 2020. And with 2020, I want to reignite my feud with Freak Show, as well as Tyler Hawk and the system. Those men drive out the best of me, and I sure as hell not done finish messing with them. Oh, LARPing! I want to start by thanking LARP Book for sponsoring me for this year, and I've had confirmation email that they will be sponsoring me through 2020. Chaoscape was a joy to be a part of. I monstered most of the weekend, and I met one of the most infamous clans known to Cornwall, which was Clan Black. They're actually really nice guys. Maybe they're bad guys now, nobody knows. Ooh. Fours and Arrows, I started off with Adam Jenkins, who was a Grey Knight. Unfortunately, he bled out because another player decided to try and drag my character rather than stopping the wound from bleeding out. It happens sometimes with these games, and it happened at Fools and Heroes Spring Fest, so at least I went out with a bang, kind of almost. Which then brought back an old character I was allowed to play again, which was Callaway Lachance, who's my cracking priest. Curious pastimes. Now, I think I found one of the best systems I've played to date. Joining with the Step Alliance, I really enjoyed my weekend with them. And I met two incredible players that really made Forge Norska Event 3 probably one of the best events I've been to, which was Rex Winchester, who plays Willow, and Becky... I'm going to use a pseudonym, which is Becky Bud, who plays Neela, which she now she turns the name to Phoenix. Now, life overall and 2020 itself, beard or not to beard? That is the question. And of course, on the 17th of December, I went to Whamhalla. My main aim for 2020 is starting to build my kids' future. Yeah. Apart from that, I'm going to keep you updated as much as I can for all my social media pages. I tried to come off social media only to be dragged back into it again. Till then, I hope to provide this channel with a lot more content. So I'm going to stop blabbering now because we have just over an hour before New Year's. And I've got to get this uploaded.
it probably won't happen till New Year's Day anyway. So keep calm, keep rocking. Let's see what this next decade brings us, eh? Love to you all.